Hello viewers. In this video we will learn how to download data from Google in ArcGIS Shapify format. Instead of digitizing roads, schools, hospitals, shops, police stations etc., this video will enable you to automatically download data GIS format. So. Let's start open Google Earth. Let's for example we want to download road Shapify between two Pakistani cities, separated apart around 1500 kilometers. In search box type Karachi to Peshawar. Now you can see blue line of 1574 km road is selected. There is option to save the line my places folder on Google Earth. There are three routes selected. Via Air, via GT Road and via Indus Highway. We will clean the data once imported as Shapify file in ArcGIS. Right click on the file in my places folder and save it as KML file. Now open Global Mapper software. Open the road file in .kml format to convert into Shapify file format. Now select Convert into Vector option. Select Shapify. As our data consists of line format so select Line option. Give a suitable name the file. Select the option split on Feature Description to recognize each feature separately. Save the Shapify. Now open ArcGIS and add the road Shapify. You can see three different routes from one city to other are recognized separately. Now you can clean the data by removing straight line showing the air travel route. Start edit session to delete extra line and save edit session. Add base map satellite imagery to verify your downloaded data. Zoom it to different levels. Change road line symbol. Similar process is repeated to download a particular school locations in Karachi. Search, for example, city school in Karachi area. There are 10 city schools in the Karachi city as given by Google. Save it into my place and as .kml file. and Global Mapper convert the KML file into Shapify file format. Mm -hmm. 
open the Shapify file in ArcGIS, zoom it to different levels. Change school point symbol. Similarly, you can search and download hospitals, coffee shops, hotels, parks and many other locations of your choice. Hope you learned new things in this tutorial. Please subscribe to my channel and get updated information regularly. Thanks.